folks, uh, you know what time it is. It's train time. So I'm Joe, your host for this episode, and today we will be talking about snuffers. So stay with us, uh, we will be back with you right after this intro. In compliance with COPA, this video is not for children under the age of 14. Your discretion is advice. Sponsored by CanadianModelRailroad.ca and by donations from patrons like you. Now, as you know, under a layout, you got buses. Uh, positive, negative, rail A, rail B, whatever you call it. And now those wires have the tendency to have a conversations to one another and it might at times have an influence on your power on the distribution of your power I might say in our layout here at Canadian model railroads we have uh, four DCC buses going underneath of, the, or of our layout and one bus that is for accessory which is only DC now, to reduce the conversation in between the wires, uh, a lot of people will use a method that is just twisting the wires as they go. Now, when you go and you have twist the wire like that, probably a few feet apart, it, it might be a little difficult to go and solder uh, the leads to your bus. Uh, the other solution is you run your bus and you use a snuffer and a snuffer is made of two parts uh, one of the part is a capacitor and the other part is a resistor the capacitor is soldered to the resistor and then that assembly is soldered in between your two ends of the bus it doesn't matter if the, which size that you put the resistor or the capacitor, it doesn't matter. As long as it's soldered at the end of the wires and you leave it that way. So it will diminish the conversation in between your wires. Now, I'm not saying that it will totally alleviate it now. And in a small module or a small layout, you probably don't necessarily have to have uh, a lot of snuffers because example your module is in between four feet and eight feet uh, you probably have your power on one end and a snuffer at the other end and that would be sufficient but when you're talking about a big layout like Canadian model railroad we got 24 feet by 34 feet with two uh, peninsula of 20 feet and then the wiring get a little bit different so instead of using a full loop around uh, like you will do on a small layout, uh, we use our power, which we use Digitrax in our case, in the middle and run the buses in a U-shape. So technically your power is going on each end, you know, so you do not have a uh, major loss of power when you get to the other end so having four DCC bus underneath of the layout that's require eight snuffers having one for the accessories on 12 volt that's mean you need two now the capacitor that you will use to do that is a 104 Z and the resistor is 100 ohms and um, it does the tricks so it's a red uh, dark wine and brown uh, resistor in here which give you the proper amperage now the snuffer when it's put together that's what it looked like it's not a big thing some of the capacitor are even smaller but have exactly the same power it depends which company made them and where you buy them and uh, they usually come in in pack of five or six you know the resistor 
come in on pack of six most of the time. Uh, some other place you can buy them in bulk. Now you don't need a, a ton of them on a layout so uh, two packs one of each will do the trick. So that's how you can alleviate uh, some conversation in between your wires and that's how a snuffer is made. So <laughs> hoping that information was good for you uh, is a different school of thought in regards of snuffer if we use them or don't use them some model rail rotor uh, will not use them don't like them don't want to have anything to do with them they don't believe in them some other do and i can assure you that in our layout <coughs> we have definitely uh, used them and we're very pleased with it uh, it has definitely uh, reduce the conversation between the wires we do not see a loss of powers towards the end of the lines so I guess it worked so anyway that's just a little bit of information for you you know to ponder on uh, this is the end of this episode thank you for watching uh, don't forget uh, to subscribe and click the little bell down there uh, so that uh, we can advise you of future videos you will see uh, on the description below uh, the, the sponsor web page and you will see also the information in regards of the snuffers so uh, feel free to comment and give us your suggestions we're happy to look at them and to respond to them thank you very much for watching us again